Rosh Hashanah is the name of Jewish New Year. The phrase literally means head of the year. The festival lasts for two days, but the date changes from year to year. This is because the dates of Jewish festivals come from the Hebrew calendar, which is different from the calendar that's used in most Western countries. Rosh Hashanah celebrates God creating the world and symbolizes a time for people to make a fresh start. People use the holiday and the days that follow it to reflect on the past year and to ask for forgiveness for anything wrong they feel they've done. This period is known as the Days of Awe. The festival also marks a time of judgment when Jewish people believe that God balances a person's good acts over the last year with their bad acts and decides what the coming 12 months will be like for them. Many Jewish families will spend some of Rosh Hashanah at a synagogue. This is the name given to the building where Jewish people go to worship. One of the traditions of Rosh Hashanah is to blow a big horn called a shofar. 100 notes are blown on the horn to create a special rhythm. The shofar is one of the world's oldest known wind instruments. Food also makes up a big part of Rosh Hashanah celebrations. Slices of apple are dipped in honey to symbolize a sweet new year ahead. Honey cake is eaten too. Some Jewish people make a sweet carrot stew called zemis and bread called kala is baked into a round shape to symbolize the circle of life and the end of the year. You might also find a pomegranate on the table because there is a belief that they contain 613 seeds. These represent each of the commandments a Jewish person is supposed to keep.